Friends, having heard how the Sabbath is good for rest and reflection, I invite you to reflect on how God might be moving in your life this day. If you have questions about your faith or would like to begin a life of faith, I would be happy to meet with you at the front of the sanctuary following our service this morning. Now, let us please stand and affirm what it is we believe as found in your bulletin this morning from the brief statement of faith. Friends, in whom do we trust? We trust in God, the Holy Spirit, everywhere the giver and renewer of life. The Spirit justifies us by grace through faith, sets us free to accept ourselves and to love God and neighbor and binds us together with all believers in the one body of Christ the Church, the same Spirit who inspired the prophets and apostles, rules our faith and life in Christ through Scripture, engages us through the Word proclaimed, claims us in the waters of baptism, feeds us with the bread of life and the cup of salvation, and calls women and men to all ministries of the Church. In a broken and fearful world, the Spirit gives us courage to pray without ceasing, to witness among all people to Christ as Lord and Savior, to unmask idolatries in church and culture, to hear the voices of people long silenced, and to work with others for justice, freedom, and peace. In gratitude to God, empowered by the Spirit, we strive to serve the Christ in our daily tasks and to live holy and joyful lives, even as we watch for God's new heaven and new earth, praying, Come, Lord Jesus.